hello guys welcome back to my channel how are you guys doing happy weekend i hope you guys are doing great it is a beautiful day here and i am here to share some beautiful remedies for you for your hair loss if you've been battling with hair loss this remedy is going to be for you if you want to grow your hair or you have a problem with your hair like alopecia this remedy is for you honestly and this is one of the reasons why i did not have any hair loss during the time i was pregnant ever since i found out about this remedy i used it during my uh, during pregnancy i did not shed any single hair loss at all my hair was still intact you know how some people will like have hair loss and during pregnancy and their hair will be shedding mine was there and this remedy it's pretty much full everywhere like a lot of people are using cloves but mine it's cloves with different things that i'm going to share with you guys this is not to make your hair shed and not to make your hair loss at all so yeah i'm going to be sharing with you cloves is amazingly good for your hair it's good for so many things but this one is a hair remedy i have cloves remedy for hair in, on my channel before but i've never shared this method with you guys so i'm sharing this method and this hair this method one will not make your hair like lose your hair at all it will grow your hair your hair will retain and will be long so i use two tablespoons of cloves i'm gonna blend it i just crush it down not truly really blend just crush it down because i still want the whole one to be there as well and i want some part to be blended so yeah i am going to be using amala oil sorry i'm gonna use oil later i'm gonna be using amala powder this is amala powder and excuse me i didn't know about this until i think late last year or early last year something like that around last year and i was like what is this and i started researching about it you guys if you research amala powder and amala oil and amala seed it's amazingly good for hair if you want to grow your hair if your hair has been lost if you have alopecia please consider using amala it's really 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 good it's also uh, I think it's from India. You pretty much um, they grow it from India, something like that. When I was doing research, I can't remember. So yeah, it's pretty much from India. And I'm also gonna be using um, uh, ginger. This is optional to be honest, but ginger also it's good for your hair. Like ginger's juice and everything like that is good for your hair. So it's optional if you don't have that's okay. You can just take the ginger out, but it will be really good if you have ginger just to like support this ingredient because we want that hair to be you know to be long and we want it to grow fast i have used ginger juice in the past to grow my hair when i first um cut my hair down i think about three years ago and my hair was slowly growing i didn't like the um I didn't like the consistency of the growth at the time so i had to like research and that time i didn't know about amala powder or oil so i was just using ginger juice and it was still helpful it wasn't it wasn't super fast at the time but it did grow my hair but when i found out about amala it like i would say triple times ginger the way ginger will grow your hair than amala and when you add the cloves it's even more faster as well all the edges because i i don't have air in my edges at all and so now i do because of all these ingredients i just do my own thing i don't waste money i research you know and because those oil that you buy from all these stores and everywhere this is what they use they just make it a bit more special and more fancier right so but you can do this at home and just do your own thing and you'll be amazed by the growth of your hair and yeah it will help you so i just added that ginger um the one sorry my baby is here i'm just breastfeeding him and i'm doing this voiceover so i just added it in the jar and I am going to be using onion. Onion juice is amazing. I do not have red onions in the house, so but I prefer to use red onions, but it will still work, it will still do the job, trust me. So if you don't have red onions, you can use the white onions, but please use red onions if you can. It just, it's so strong. It's really, really, really amazing, really, really good. So yeah, <laughs> my baby just here breastfeeding and he thinks i'm talking to him so i'm going to cut about two tablespoons of um, onions and add it in the jar all the ingredients will be listed on the screen so i'll list everything so you don't get confused i know you guys like me to like list my ingredients so 
I'm gonna list it on the screen so you guys can have the, uh, can uh, have it there. So I'll add the onions in the jar, and I am going to add some water. I'm gonna add hot water, like boiling water, not hot water from the tap. You want to boil the water and you want to add it into it. So yeah, I am gonna do that. For this remedy, I used about three and a half cups of water in here, and I am going to sieve it because the ingredient is still very, very strong, so I am not going to throw it out when I sieve it. But I let it sit for about 10 minutes, and I am going to sieve it, and I'm going to add the next hot water in the shaft that left, and I'm also going to be sieving that. added about three and a half cups of water again in the shaft and I am going to be letting it sit because I need it to be extracted and I'm going to add about half teaspoon of not even up to of peppermint oil peppermint oil is absolutely good for um, boosting the um, what is it called the blood in your head to like make your hair grow so once like your hair it's like uh, the blood is boosting up to your head and it's making blood circulations your hair will grow and also around your body so that's why you need mint like i'm not putting too much because mint is very very hot so not even i would say like quarter of teaspoon just in there and i'm gonna add the other uh what the other juice from the second bottle when it extracted, I'm going to add it in the other bottle. So it's quarter teaspoon for everything. So I'm going to be throwing everything together when I drain it in the second time. I'm just waiting for this one to like extract it. And I'll add the old juice together. And I'm not going to add any more mint tea. Uh, sorry, mint oil in there. And that will be it. And you want to use this to like um, wash your hair after you shampoo, after you like wash all the dirt out. So you want to use it to rinse your hair and you want to do it once a week. Once a week, you want to do it. So when you use it to rinse your hair, cover it with shower cap and let it sit for about 15 minutes. You can do something else in the shower and you completely use uh, cool water to rinse out your hair. Uh, and this will help you grow your hair. The blood circulation will flow properly. Your hair will grow. If you have alopecia, I'll suggest you do this twice a week because alopecia is very, very strong um, when it comes to like, you know, eating your hair. 
so you want to use this twice a week and it will help you trust me so yeah that's pretty much everything i hope you guys enjoy if you do please give me a thumbs up and subscribe like i said i'm still gonna add the two juice together after the other one extracted and i don't have to add any more mint please make sure you share this video to friends and family and thumbs up and subscribe please i beg you subscribe to my channel and share my videos god bless you and i'll see you guys again bye